Hello everyone, today we're talking to Danish about the merger and why we're excited with this new seamless solution and the opportunities they're gonna to provide to us. So Danish, I want you to tell me in great detail how, why you're excited, what are the biggest opportunities here for an integrated solution between, uh, between our two products? Okay, so I feel, uh, Adam, that uh, iPhone is a super complex product, but it's really simple to use because they had to integrate the software and the hardware and everything together. So be able to give the seamless experience, right? So what I feel about that in for having successful many services with client engagement, they always need a software, which is one thing, but they need process as well and a lot of content as well. So they don't realize this is not really a software problem only. So why I'm excited about that is that now we are able to have a complete account management and VCI uh, process what you developed with Skip over the years. And we can seamlessly integrate the software for having those type of uh, processes um, easier to adopt. Why this is important because MSPs doesn't have time. They have, uh, you know, really a, a couple of minutes to prep for a meeting, do the meeting, do the follow up. So that's critical to follow a process inside the software. The second thing, what I would like to, uh, or why I'm excited is that we have a lot of content everywhere and each and every managed service has to create their own content for stack adoption, for uh, QBRs, for the agenda, for the what you send before the meeting, after the meeting, projects, projects, uh, roadmaps, a lot of, lot of content each and every uh, managed service provider is creating. Now we are able to unify these in a version which can be adopted super quickly. If you want, you can change it, but that's part of a bigger framework and part of uh, a software which is helping you to go through. That's give large companies ability to scale these account management and VCIO uh, stuff. And for small organizations, just make sure they are able to do it quickly and efficiently and, and generate really, really uh, great client experience. That's why I'm really um, you know, excited because now we have these different uh, items and those items can actually uh, uh, click together. Let me put you a little bit on the spot here. Why not do this from the beginning? Back seven years ago when you first started, why not just start with a completely seamless solution? So the problem here, Adam, is that, uh, you know, uh, this is a really complex problem. And you, as a human being, you can't design a software engineer or the UI aspects and also understand the content and go and have client meetings and understand what they are doing. You need a complete team for that. And we didn't have the resources, we didn't have the, 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 the talent behind it. And what we tried to do over the last two years or three years that try to make it happen. But I just, I felt we are not iPhone. I felt like it's harder for the clients to put those together by themselves because a framework was a little bit disjoint from the software. The software was created for a certain uh, uh, um, uh, uh, thinking process. And, and also software is easy to develop. It's, you can put a bunch of features everywhere, but make sure that the software can serve super small MSPs into like enterprise MSPs as well in the same software, that's not easy to do, to give enough customization and even get rid of customization to make sure they are not making too many decisions. So this balance was really hard for us. And I feel this merge when we can actually, uh, you know, make decisions together on that and align everything, that's basically a game changer here. Yeah, I think, I think for us, like uh, with, you know, Skip getting feedback and myself getting feedback and Miles getting feedback. One of the things that really differentiated working together was the fact that we were evolving and we were we were evolving because the community was giving us such great feedback. Yeah. We're in blue ocean. We are the thought leaders here because of the members. And we said, hey, how do we make this better? Where are the pain points? And over the last few years, we've seen like this slowly integrating, hey, this is what's gonna help the members more. This is what they want. And we had this amazing tool and how do we make it better? And it, it became this obvious, why don't we just make one seamless solution so that a, a MSP can come in and just start kicking ass where they are. Yeah. And I think that's what I saw is like, there was a great product that became even better.
And Adam, it's uh, it don't get me wrong. It's like uh, again, it, this is not a software problem. For those managed services, have to create their own stack. They have to design their own processes. They have to differentiate. They have to make sure this is uh, scalable. So it's not just the owner does that. It's a huge complexity for them to adopt a really uh, a client engagement process, which is actually differentiate themselves and generate uh, client engagement. And that's what we try to integrate together so they can go take it and use it and not like additional customization, go there, add this, more template. No, simple and usable based on battle-tested content. So that's why I'm like super excited. And that's actually leading to the second part, which we are going to talk about is the unified, simplified product line, which is, an, uh, which is the other uh, section. I, I am so stoked to talk about that in our next se segment where we can talk about what was the resulting set of this brainchild, this seamless solution, now what? Rather than just saying, oh, it's easier now, but there's actual tangible results that affect everybody in the community. And we'll talk about that in the next video. Thanks, Danish. Thank you.